Newburgh police in Orange County, New York, are looking for those responsible for a shooting that injured four teenagers. The mayor and community members there were on the streets today demanding something be done about the gun violence plaguing the city's young people. CBS 2's Jenna DeAngelis has more. Disturbing video shows a fight in the street Wednesday afternoon, followed by the sound of gunfire and teens literally running for their lives. Newburgh police were alerted to the gunshots on William Street and found a crime scene spanning several blocks. Four teens ages 16 to 18 were shot. In this incident, four different handguns were discharged. 17 shell cases were recovered from multiple scenes. Investigators released new video which shows injured teens trying to get into cars and a suspect next to a school bus firing his gun allegedly toward police. This is a call for action for all the stakeholders in this community to act and to address our troubled youth. The shooting prompted the two-day closure of some Newburgh Free Academy campuses and a peace walk Friday afternoon. We need help identifying who these kids are. This so gathering, you know, organized by SNUG, Newburgh's anti-gun violence outreach program, funded by the state's Division of Criminal Justice Services, made up of community members like Arenzo Charles. To have this presence is something I didn't have when I was this age. So to be out here to give these kids the opportunity to know they have an alternative to that decision. Jamaica Hall lost her 17-year-old son, Demarcus Hooper, to gun violence, joining this walk and spreading awareness of her Newburgh support group in his memory. My goal for this space is to ultimately become like a teen drop-in outreach center where it's surfaced around families and teens that are going through trauma or tragic loss. Police say one teen remains hospitalized in stable condition. The other three have been discharged. No suspects have been identified just yet, but are believed to be younger group-involved members tied to the city. In Newburgh, Orange County, Jenna DeAngelis, CBS2 News.